So for the optimistic cynic guy. Shit, ho got a hell of a grip. It's never a problem to niggas is piling and bitches they all. Epic and welcome to some more Saints Row Get Out of Hell. Uh, <clears throat> I am still sick from the other time, but um, I would just like to say I did a recording of this game earlier, and apparently I lost my um, I lost video for it. So we're just going to continue on from where I left off. We left off where we uh became loyal to the twins uh and blackbeard and we're just going to have to work uh basically we're going to rally with them so they can give us their stuff yeah so we're just going to fly over there i don't know why they um you know, I don't know why they gave us, like, I got cars and stuff in this game, but you can fly, so what's, what's the point, really? Alright, so let me hop back over. Yo, back be <laughs> The Baron! Oh, I have to do the, I haven't did the summoning All tutorial? Right, it's time for your lesson. Let's summon me favorite scurvy riddled hellion, the imp. Why don't you start off by summoning an imp to take out those enemies? There you go, mate. Now take your mother. Those God, I am sick. Are vicious. Now let's practice your aim. Take down the uh. demons on the islands. Few things are as rewarding Boom. as someone into service, am I right? Now get going. There's a whole wide world waiting to be plundered. Yeah, of course. Alright, I rally with I think that's I think that's what I have to do. Yeah. The oh, forge is prime real estate in hell. This smoggy shithole is located over the richest mineral veins in the afterlife. You want to hurt Hell's infrastructure? Here's where you do it. One of these days I'm gonna get Blackbeard off that boat and onto the fucking squash court. Well, hurry up and get him off. I... I have to rally Shakespeare. God, this feels good. Goodness, you have a lot of stamina. Sign up to make it over there. Right, so we're gonna rally with Shakespeare. I always go the wrong way. There we go. Lights up. William Shakespeare, humanity's greatest playwright and hell's most diabolical purveyor of entertainment, looks on as a brave mortal on an Orphean quest enters. The bard's interest is piqued, and he looks to test his visitor's metal. The masked tragedies were used to enemies cowering as they approached. But soon they realized that they faced a foe with courage and nobility. Traits uncommon in the fires of perdition. The inciting incident resolved. The time had come. For rising action! Come on, come on, come on. God. 
God, my aim is terrible. The battle raged on below, and as bullets and blood flew, the bard arched a curious eyebrow. Could this mortal be the exact fit that Shakespeare needed? You belong. This battle is far mm. from over, mortal. Arise. And now, Act Three. This is good for the soul. I was knife that guy. Let's kill this guy. The conflict resolved. Shakespeare eagerly awaited meeting the champion that dispatched so many of his men. Undoubtedly, they were here for yeah, the Yeah, man, aid. shut up. And while happy endings were not a thing found in hell, Shakespeare always had a soft spot for companies. In the land of the living, William Shakespeare is regarded as one of the most prolific playwrights of all time. However, to the denizens of hell, the bard is seen in a far different light. After selling his soul for fame and adoration, Shakespeare served in hell as Satan's spy master general. In doing his duty, Shakespeare would punish the souls he was investigating by forcing them to perform in grotesque passion plays for Satan's amusement. But in a Twelfth Night-esque twist, Shakespeare found himself living a double life. While he projected an image of cruelty, his heart was as soft as Jezebel's. In secret, he would tutor her on the classics and act out the works of his mortal days. When Satan found out, he cast Shakespeare out of the palace, believing that the poet would be tormented by the populace of hell, far out of Jezebel's sight. But Satan had not counted on the bard's cunning. Embracing his persona of master torturer, Shakespeare and his followers, the tragedies, took root in the entertainment district, biding their time for revenge. For revenge! And so Shakespeare called forth the Deus Ex Machina to bestow our protagonist with the arcane power. Of course, Tom. All right, now I got stomp element four. All right. Lights up. The mortal stands in the training grounds, eager to try out his new force stomp power on the group of demons in front of them. To battle. Act one, scene two, in which our protagonist kills more. Act two, in which our protagonist is greeted by foul imps. Bitey little bastard. Act three, in which our protagonist learns that Force Stomp even works on flying enemies, enabling them to remove a... The day is won, and the curtain closes on our noble hero. God, did he ever just shut up? Alright. Kind of really Vlad. Damn. That is vicious. Gotta pick it up. Get this closure. Oh, 
ใจขโมยนี่คือสิ่งที่ผมพูดถึงมาดูว่าพวกมันสามารถทำอะไรคืออะไรนี่คือการเป็นรถทำอะไร The horn on the bus goes beep 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 beep. What if they wanted to torture you? Why'd they use the short version of the song? This, the short version. Oh yeah, the wipers on the bus go swish swish swish. The whole war on the bus goes hey hey hey. Fuck! I died. This is some bullshit. Huh. That's the first time I died. What <clears throat> if they wanted to torture you? Why'd they use the short? Let's get these guys with guns now. Is the short version? Oh yeah, the wipers on the bus go swish swish swish. The hobo on the bus goes hey hey hey. My mom had like eighty of them. Anyone got a mop? Kill him. I'm getting shot. Kill that guy. Kill that guy. All of them are dying. Who's next? Who can save you now? Right, let's get this guy. Come, let us return to my castle, so we may plot our next steps in proper surrounds. All right. 
Johnny led Vlad back to his castle, which since his incarceration became a haven for frat parties and squatters. But the systematic impaling of trespassers would have to wait. Vlad was a man of his word, and was eager to provide intel that could aid in hobbling Satan's armies. Alright. Well, you know, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Like, comment, subscribe for more Saints Row Get Out of the House. And if you guys want to see any other games, feel free to let me know down in the comments below. And uh, feel and feel free to you know comment on if this video needs if this video needs any improvement. Uh, this is Epic Journey, and I hope you guys have an awesome day. Peace.